Greetings, greetings, good day, my good people. Back with you, this is your boy Art Zara live in effect with another coach reveal and review. Okay, you know, I really, really, really love taking my time and uh, reviewing these coach products because I spent a lot of time and a lot of capital on these items because I just like the way they look and I like the way they feel. I mean, I just I, I can't make much excuse for uh, the way that I roll with the uh, brand itself, but it's, like I said, it's, 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 it's the best out there in terms of, to me, uh, quality, comfort, uh, you know, everything that you can envision for needing something that looks great, feels great, wears great, uh, age is great. You know, I can go on and on and on, but the coach brand has been around for a long time. And, you know, uh, you know, although it's, it's, it's purchasing a lot of other brands out there, but at the end of the day, you get what you pay for. Uh, there are a lot of lesser known brands that have some decent quality items. Personally, I like the top tier quality stuff or let's say a better level of quality uh, for my particular items. Coach, yeah, of course, uh, it, it's not Louis Vuitton and all the names that, you know, clash with it. But Coach holds its own. You know, that's just the way I see it. Uh, you know, some of them, it's basically the same material. Uh, you know, I, I don't I don't see personally a, a, a very... Uh, a, a contrast between the types of material that's being used. The, the canvases are all about the same. The stitching and the quality and the craftsmanship is all about the same to me. I just like the Coach brand because it's not as uh, overpronounced. Let's just say it that way. So what I want to review today is what I have here. I picked this up, uh, I would say, a little ways ago. And I've been waiting for the opportunity to review this particular item. Show everybody out there what this looks like. Now this looks, this pretty much is a miniature backpack. This is similar to uh, a, an item that would hold very decent amount. This is a very decent size bag, to be honest with you. It's not a huge, it's not a full size backpack. It's like maybe two thirds the size of a, of a small backpack. And so it's it has all the compartments in here that you need. Now you can get maybe like a, a Surface Go in there or maybe like a, a A7 tab from Samsung or something like that. Maybe an iPad mini. Uh, you might be able to squeeze a regular iPad in here, but definitely not the Pro. That's not going to go in this bag. You could probably get the iPad Mini in there, something to that degree or another. But it, it really will fit some pretty decent items. And it only has one shoulder strap that slings crossbody style. You can wear it on one shoulder if you like, but I prefer to wear it crossbody style on the back. You can wear it on the front if you like, but it really depends on how you feel about it. Okay, so this item has a nice refined calfskin leather. It's really nice and supple. It's, you're gonna find that on all coach, coach items. Now this is an, uh, an item that once you get the feel of it, it really feels, it just feels rich. You know, it's really soft and man, you just wanna, you just wanna hold on to it all day long. You don't even wanna put it down. It's just that nice of a leather, man. I, I don't know how else to say it, you know? I like the coach uh, raised uh, logo on this particular item. And the D-ring, obviously, you can use for keys and stuff like that. It really depends on the way that you feel about this particular uh, this tab here. I like the bottom where the uh, stitching is all the nylon thick st stitching. It's not the stuff that'll fray over time. And that's why they use this stuff on sailboats and stuff like that, because it needs to withstand wind and really, really strong elements from Mother Nature that may come at you from out of nowhere. Um, but it's double stitched here. And again, it's another area of this nice, thick, supple leather on this thing. I mean, you can't really beat the quality of these coach bags. And I'm telling you, you, you can go out there and get all these other items you want, but it's something about the way that coach leather, it's, it's how they treat it. It's, 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 it's how they, it's how they, I don't know what they do to this stuff at their tannery, uh, wherever they're getting their leather from the tannery must be doing an awesome job because they keep cracking out some really nice leathers, man. It's, it's awesome. You have the gun metal finish on this bag. Uh, YKK zipper is real nice and buttery smooth. You can see uh, me zipping on it real easy. Doesn't get caught. I can do this a million times and nothing will happen to it. It'll just go on and on and on. I love the way it moves, it glides. Uh, this compartment here will hold items like your keys and things like that. Um, I, matter of fact, this, this is my bag I'm carrying every day right now. And see my keys are in here, uh, you see? So I, I just, I throw my keys in there from time to time and then oh there you go so i even have the uh <laughs> the coach key ring i even put that on there so you know i was in there one day and decided let me just grab that too just a little key ring 
that uh, that you get from Coach. So I thought that was pretty cool. But I keep my keys uh, in this particular uh, pouch along with some other items like your chapstick and stuff like that you keep in this area. You can throw your phone in there. It's obviously big enough for something like that. Your wallet can go in here. Uh, you know, any small items, hand sanitizers, little bottles, stuff like that. A pack of crackers or something like that. You, know, you can put anything you want in here. You can even put a sandwich in there if you want to pack a little small light lunch. Throw a fruit in there, a banana, an orange or whatever. You know, pack your little small little items and throw in. Mints or chewing gum. Stuff like that. Uh, you know, I wouldn't say you could stick documents in here, but if you want to fold up a little envelope that you want to take to the post office, that'll fit in there. A stack of mail. You can stick your mail in here. That'll fit perfectly. It's long enough. I would say it's about, uh, I would give it about eight or nine inches on this particular compartment from top to bottom. But it, it will definitely fit you some mail and stuff in there. It's definitely deep enough. This Hudson pack is really good for that. Uh, then you go over to the tall compartment, which is, I can just get to it. This is where your uh, your larger items will go. It's nice, same zipper, same buttery smooth zipper. Um, now you can keep some other things in here. Right now, I have my Corona mask in there, my um, COVID mask, keep that in there. So when I'm out and about, obviously I keep in here what's in my bag, pack of uh, <laughs> chewing gum. And uh, so in my bag, pretty much, I have the, uh, in the second compartment, it's two zippers in it. You got this zipper and then you have this particular inside zipper, which basically will house like your wallet in here. I have my wallet in there. I have an, and obviously that's a coach wallet. So, and I keep that uh, on hand. So basically my wallet sticks in this particular, in this little uh, sub pocket area, but extra added security. And I, then I keep some business cards in there and stuff like that. When I run into potential people I want to do business with or something like that, I stick all that in there. And we just go that route with it, you know? So in essence, this bag has, of course, another zipper. In this area, this compartment, like I said, you can keep a lot of stuff in here. This is a backpack type of size uh, pocket. I know you can't really get a good look at it from here, but uh, just me just moving the camera here, you can see this is a very deep little bag. It's, 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 it's very deep. The bag is not huge. Like I said, it's about two thirds the size of a backpack, a small backpack, but it's really nice though. I mean, you're gonna get everything you ask for with this little thing. Now, we zip it back up with the pull tabs that are leather, obviously. Okay, you switch it around to the back. What do you have? Hang tag. You have another little leather uh, uh, enclosure here that basically uh, provides the security for the strength of holding stuff in this bag. So it's not gonna rip and tear along the edge like a backpack, like the cheap backpacks did back in the back in the day, back in the 90s when you're a little kid, 80, 90 in the 80s and the 90s when the backpacks are ripped like right around in here. Uh, that's not the case on this bag. It's very well stitched inside the bag. So, and I, I kind of like, I like all leather bags, but this is a different feel. It has that nice little mesh uh, back padding for it. So that way, if you have anything heavy back there that may be protruding into your back, maybe something with sharp corners on it or something like that, this will add extra padding security or extra padding to your back. So your back is secure from anything like that. And then obviously, the uh, the bag picks up with the stitching along the base. So you're not gonna get things that are gonna rip through and tear through the base of the bag. It's gonna be solid all the way from the top to the bottom. Uh, obviously you have your D-rings on the sides that connects to your shoulder strap, which is nylon, obviously it's a nylon. It's the same stuff they use for seat belts. So it's that type of material, like a nylon or whatever you wanna call that. Uh, obviously here's your adjustable buckle. And here's my one of the things I like about it. This little, uh, this this uh, adjustment lever here, this, this little clamper, you can adjust it from either side. You can go left side or right side with this uh, adjustment buckle, and you can do it on the fly. So this, uh, I think it's a dog leash clamp is what they call this, the dog leash clamp. But it's nice and thick, it's heavy, it's, it's, it's really solid metal material. Uh, it's definitely not some cheap material. They put a lot of time, and it's, it's a nice finish on it too. It's a real shiny gun metal. I don't know if you guys can get a good look at that. Nice shiny gun metal to this particular buckle and the little dog leash clamp. Really nice. So that's pretty much it for this particular item. It is the Hudson Sling Pack. You guys need to go and check this one out. Get this on. Uh, take this item and uh, you know carry it every day. You know put your everyday items in there and uh, have a blast with it. You know. So that's pretty much the gist of this one. Again, this is your boy Art Czar with another review. 
Like, share, subscribe to the content. I'll drop more as time goes on because we have plenty more to go. All right. Thanks a lot, guys. Leave me a comment down below. Peace.